Okay guys, I just rolled up to Walmart. <laughs> I just need a few things, so we're gonna pop in. weird right now like I don't know I don't think lonely is the right word but maybe just like alone like I don't know it just feels so different like I don't know it's just like trying to figure out what stores are in my area and like going to places I've never been before it's like the same but different and yeah I don't know it's just so weird and I guess I normally don't go like grocery shopping um by myself like normally i'm with shane so maybe it's just like a bit of adjusting to not being in that relationship anymore but yeah i, I just i'm feeling like so weird tonight <laughs> um but that's just part of the process anyways i thought that i would show you what i got in, at walmart i'm so exhausted also by the way like i feel like my eyes are just like burning out of my face um i didn't really get anything exciting I got a bunch of cleaning stuff, hand soap, a toilet scrubber, coffee filters, dish soap. I got blueberries um, and Cheerios. That's what I'm gonna have for breakfast tomorrow. Actually, I think I'm gonna have a bowl right now too because I'm so hungry and this is just gonna be like an easy, an easy thing for me to eat um, because I already have oat milk in the fridge. I got coffee, just a cheap kind for now. Um, peanut butter and jam because I also have bread here. Of course, I got a couple of my favorite creamers. Uh, cinnamon, I've been out of cinnamon for quite a while now. And then the rest is just boring cleaning stuff. Um, like compost bags, kitchen garbage bags, and I got a bath mat. I was waffling for so long and being so indecisive about what bath mat I was gonna buy, and then I just ended up picking up this one at Walmart because it's just so annoying not having a bath mat, and I thought that this was fine. Like, it's just gray, dark gray. She cute, whatever, she will do the job. Um, so yeah, oh, I think I'm gonna try to track down my body wash too so that I can have a shower. Um, I should have kept that out with my other stuff, but I'm sure it'll be easy to find. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have my trios, get ready for bed, and hopefully have a really good sleep because I'm literally so exhausted. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. <laughs> I slept not bad, but I'm literally exhausted and so tired still. Mm, maybe I'll feel better after I have my coffee. Oh my goodness. Okay, where is everything?
Okay guys, we have Wi-Fi! Oh, that is such good news, bless. It actually took way longer than I thought for this to be installed, but I'm so glad it's done. Um, now I can finish getting this place together. I'm actually like way further than I thought I would be. Like I'm probably half unpacked, which is crazy. Um, I just put together my little Dyson stand as well. I have to go back tomorrow and get some more stuff from um, my old place and my Dyson's still there. So um, it's gonna live on there. I'm gonna be moving that plant shelf out of the way. Um, yeah, so this morning my Ikea cabinet, I noticed that a pane of glass was popped out and I could not get it back in. Um, so I took to Instagram, which of course everybody helped me out there and told me to unscrew the top and loosen it up and then that worked great. I was able to just pop the glass back into place. Um, but now I'm thinking, oh, I don't know, at first I thought I wanted to have the Ikea cabinet in my bedroom, but now I'm thinking that I actually want to put it over there and then I can move that black shelf in the bedroom. I don't know and I made well I didn't make but Hillary helped me it the cabinet was there and then she helped me move it into the bedroom and now I want to move it right back there I don't know if I should try to move it by myself or if I should just wait until she can help me again <laughs> so annoying anyways I'm just gonna carry on with my unpacking and then I'm gonna need to go to the store later on today again um it just seems like the list of things i need is never ending like i just keep finding more things to add to the list um there's just so many things that you don't even think about when you move but um yeah i need to go get some groceries so that i can get back on track with my meal planning um and then just some random household things that i need as well i need a couple of garbage cans and stuff like that so yeah that's the plan i'm hoping that by the end of today this place is going to be put together like it's not going to be, you know, decorated the way exactly I want it. Um, and I'm going to be getting some new furniture whenever it's restocked. But I think it's going to be, like, livable by the end of today. So we shall see. Oh, and also I miss Olive so much. I think that's part of the reason I just, like, feel so weird and lonely. Like, I'm so used to having the dogs and people around. And, yeah, I don't know. I just feel so weird. Um, so I think that once I have Olive, I think I'm going to bring her here tomorrow. And I think that once she's here, it's just going to feel more like home you know and then we can get into our routine of walking around and we can explore the area and stuff so yeah i'm excited to have her here
I'm so hungry. It is 5.04, so I'm gonna see what I can come up with for dinner because I don't want to have a third meal of Cheerios and I don't really feel like going out and buying anything. <laughs> this is what we're working with, friends. <laughs> I'm gonna do tofu and yeah, tofu, hmm. If I can find some veg, there's corn, edamame. Should I do some edamame and corn? Why not? Okay, so I have some quinoa in my cupboard as well. So I think I'm gonna have quinoa. I'm gonna air fry tofu. And then I'm gonna just have some of those frozen veg on the side. So yes. Moving meals. <laughs> Tofu is all good to go. I just put a little bit of olive oil and then my obsession, this vegan chickenless seasoning from Trader Joe's. Now I need to pop these suckers into the air fryer. So there's like very minimal counter space here i need to get like some sort of surface a small table or like those little islands you can buy or something because there's just yeah no counter space um and there's also no dishwasher so i basically need to be washing this up like as soon as i use it which is fine this is all fine it's all things that i can work around it's just like new things that i need to form into habits <laughs> Okay, so this is what I have come up with. That is, is not the most gourmet meal I've ever made in my life, but it's gonna be delicious, I can tell. Um, so yeah, we just have our veggies, our quinoa. I put a little bit of nutritional yeast, salt and pepper on here, and then our fried tofu. I am just, you know, thankful to have a meal right now, so it's gonna be divine. <laughs> so Why don't you put it up high, like over there? Okay, that's fine. Oh yeah, maybe this shot forward. Oh, my nasty phone. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Okay. I don't know about this. Do yours is just have all here like this? Yes. Okay. Oh, boom. No, these are different. Oh. No, right here. Right here. Wait, these are different. <laughs> oh, no, maybe they're the same. Oh. Same. But how how come what are your rolls look like? You have these two up here. I have two that are like innies and then two that are like outies. <laughs> kind of. Yeah, okay. Oh, these are the ones, I bet. Hello, happy Sunday. I have not vlogged in a few days. My memory card, um, my camera stopped filming when Hillary and I were building my bed because the memory card was full and I just hadn't exported the footage off of my memory card and then so that I could delete everything so that I could vlog again. <laughs> Long story short, I am back. Um, I have room on my memory card again, so I'm back to vlogging. I've just kind of been doing things around here and just getting settled though for the past few days. There hasn't been anything like 
too exciting really going on um i did get groceries and stock up on some essentials and stuff like that um but yeah i feel like i'm kind of like getting my bearings getting into the swing of things now so i will be back on the vlog today is just kind of like a getting organized for the work week i'm planning on kind of getting back to normal scheduled content for this week and i'm really excited about that i have my video already uploaded for tomorrow it's all scheduled and ready to go it's going to be a a live premiere one so i'll be on there chatting with everyone tomorrow morning i just had a shower and did my skincare i went for a run this morning just around my neighborhood to kind of check it out i'm gonna go pick up olive tomorrow so i'm so excited to have her here it's just gonna feel so much better and she's she's so good for me because i because i tend to hermit like even this past week like there's been several days where i just didn't leave my house and granted i'm busy doing things here but i will just do that in my life so when i have olive i uh go walk new places i have to you know walk three times a day i it's just very she's just very good for me mentally so it'll be really good to have her here and kind of get into our little routine together but yeah my place is a bit of a hot mess at the minute it's kind of like at the stage where i'm like okay is this gonna get it's gotten worse before it gets better um i just have so much stuff that i need to like move and deal with today i have a lot of cardboard i need to deal with all my recycling and trash and um stuff like that i also have to get ready for the week and do my google calendar and kind of get organized i edited uh my video this morning my bed is a hot mess everything's kind of a hot mess right now <laughs> i literally have laundry hanging off of it but yeah i'm not gonna lie this past week has been tough for me like i've officially been here for one week now and it's just it's just an adjustment and i know everything is going to be fine and i'm already feeling better and just like more settled and i'm just feeling good now that i'm back into cooking and exercising um so yeah it's just an adjustment like it's normal to feel weird the first week that you move to a different city right i will say the one thing that has been like amazing and so helpful is just being closer to hillary it's just like it's just so nice to have such a supportive best friend so close now um so that has been just lovely we went for a really nice walk and coffee the other day and it's just so crazy just being able to drive like 15 minutes and instead of driving an hour and a half to see her so yeah, that's been really good. I have spent like $300 on groceries, you guys. And you know when you spend so much money on groceries and then you expect your fridge to look like so nice and full? I mean, I guess it looks like not bad. I was expecting it to look a little more full, but this is what we are working with. I got these produce containers, not these. Um, That's my lunch. But I got these produce containers um, the other day. They make your fruit and vegetables last way longer. I had, not these ones, but similar ones um, at my old place. I just kind of left them for Shane. But yeah, they have like a little like grate thing here. So it keeps all your stuff up. And then for some things you add water and some things you don't. And some things you like open these little vents and some, some things you close them. They're really awesome. I actually want to get another set. But yeah, it's my exciting purchase of the week. I'm gonna do some cleaning, some organizing. I went and bought um, these bins, these like long flat bins. This is really similar to the one that I keep my soil mix in, um, but these are for storage under my bed. I need to store like a lot of shoes and stuff under there. It's really one of the only spaces that I have storage in this place. So I'm gonna do that today and just kind of get, get a handle on all of this like cardboard and just unpack. I only have a few boxes left to unpack, but I'm gonna do that um and just get ready for the week so that is my plan i hope that you guys are well and had a really awesome week
Monday. It has been a busy morning. What time is it right now? It's 11.02 right now. Um, I have already done my workout, gotten ready, had breakfast. Um, I did a live premiere thing for my video and chatted with a whole bunch of you, which was really awesome. Um, I just filmed a Patreon video and I am just hopping on my computer to edit that. I wanted to be getting some work done this morning because this afternoon I'm gonna be driving back to my old place to pick up Olive, which I'm so excited to see her. I haven't seen her in days now and I miss her so freaking much and I'm just so excited to bring her here and just kind of get us both into our new little routine. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep on working and then I will talk to you guys once I am going to pick up my little mouse. Okay, I'm kind of in a rush because I need to leave. Um, to go back to Nanaimo in like half an hour and I have to water my greenhouse cabinet or at least most of my greenhouse cabinet <laughs> but I really want to make a juice <laughs> which is a whole procedure but I'm just gonna do it I just had a sip and it's pretty good, honestly. I need to put an ice cube in here though because it's kind of warm. Hey guys, what's up? I am halfway to Nanaimo right now. I'm just in the drive-thru because I'm getting my iced soy latte with toffee nut, light ice. <laughs> That's my go-to, I love this drink so much. I actually haven't been drinking coffee in the afternoons, but because this is like my treat that I get maybe once every week or two, I am just going for it. So yeah, it's a really nice like kind of overcast cloudy day too. Um, boxes in the back because I'm gonna be bringing some breakable things back with me. So close to seeing Olive. I can't wait. I'm actually running a little bit early. I'm debating whether I should stop at like Michael's or HomeSense or somewhere just to run in and take a peek. I might. I'm gonna see how long this drive through takes. This one tends to take for freaking ever. I'm gonna see how long it takes and then um, see how I'm doing for time. There's somebody in their car right beside me, but I ended up getting the uh, shaken oats. What is this? Uh, iced brown sugar shaken oat shaken espresso, whatever that drink is. It's really good. This is the other one that I get. I don't know why I just changed my mind at the last minute. It's less sweet. So um, yeah, really good. So I thought that there was a HomeSense and a Michaels in this city that I'm passing through and there's neither. <laughs> But there is a winner's, so I'm gonna pop in there. I just have like a few minutes to kill. Um, I was thinking I should have went to a car wash instead. I don't know why I'm ending up here at the freaking store. Um, but I'm just gonna go take a look. I feel like a middle-aged housewife coming here during the middle of the day on a weekday. Um, but I'm just gonna go look and see. Okay, I am back and I need to get going now. Oh, it's hot with the sweater on inside the car. Um, so they had like, they had some fall and Halloween stuff, but nothing that like really caught my eye. There was this cool plate that was like Ouija board style, but I was like, where, where am I going to put this? Like, what am I going to do with this? I don't know. I need more services in my home to put things, but yeah, I'm just going to drive, finish my drive now. There's about 45 minutes left of it. I can see that Hillary is texting me. <clears throat> So yeah, I will talk to you guys later, probably once I have Olive. Checking it out. <laughs> you like it? Yeah, that's your couch, baby. <laughs> yeah, 
the couch. Do you like it here? You like it? It airwags. She hasn't lived somewhere with carpet before. What's that? Huh. You good girl. Let's close these blinds. Hey guys, what's up? Happy Wednesday. I did not vlog yesterday because I was basically just being present and getting olives settled. Um, the past couple days we've just been kind of exploring trails and places that we can walk around here. So yeah, I've just been spending time with her and she's settling in really well. She's actually doing even better than I expected. So that's honestly such a relief for me. Yesterday I was not feeling great i was just really anxious i didn't really sleep the night before like the night that i brought her over just because i was so worried about her adjusting and i just feel so bad moving her around so many times and yeah but she's doing well so whoo anyways i wanted to hop on here um because i'm gonna be opening some mail that i got i grabbed some packages that were um at my old place when i was there on monday wait what day are we in today? Oh yeah, Wednesday, okay. Yeah, I was there on Monday. Um, the first one I've already opened, but I cannot wait to try these on. So I had to show them to you because, because I just love this brand. Um, so these are new PJs from Print Fresh. I already have a couple of sets from them and I love them so much. All of their patterns are so freaking cute. So they reached out to me because they're launching a new print called orange grove um so i'll show you what that looks like i got like the long like the pants and the shirt um pj set of this one look how cute i love fruit patterns um so it has oranges and butterflies and bees like oh my goodness and orange and green are my favorite colors so i love these so much i can't wait to try them on i have not tried them on yet this is the top and then they actually uh, sent me a little eye mask that matches and I sleep with an eye mask every night you guys so yeah love this um I think that this was limited edition or maybe maybe they still sell them but I know that they were giving these free for like the first however many people that ordered this set but that has gone past um I do have a discount code with this brand though if you want to check out their pjs they have like house coats and stuff or robes I remember one time people were making fun of me for, I think it was because I said house coat and people in the US call it a robe. I don't know, I've always called it a house coat. <laughs> um, this is the other one that I got. This is, I think it's called Lime Zest and this is like their nighty version. Remember in one of my last vlogs, I was like, where can I get uh, like nightgowns because I'm an old woman, I'm, I'm obsessed. Um, well, Print Fresh has some and they're so cute. They're like the little button up um shirts but long i got this in a size medium because i wanted it to be nice and baggy i think i got the, i think i get the regular pjs in a size small though okay so that's the first stuff i got which i just can't wait um to try those on and the next thing i got is this round tube it's literally busting out of here so i've got to open this up um Okay, so this is what it is. Oh, this is so freaking cool. I love this one. Okay, so this is a potting mat and this is from Leaflet Co. I have a couple of um, other potting mats from them, which I absolutely love. And she reached out and wanted to send me their unicorn one. Um, so this is like holographic. How freaking cool is this? What the heck? This is amazing. This is definitely gonna be my new favorite potting mat. And this feels so sturdy. It's like thick. Let's put it together and see what it looks like. I love that the snaps are black. I don't know if the snaps are black on all of them because I know some of them you can choose the color. Maybe she just knows. Okay, there it is all put together. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is my new favorite one for sure. I love this. I will link it down below in the description. I'll link all this stuff that I'm mentioning in the description box, but I get a lot of questions about my potting mats whenever I use them in videos. Um, so yeah, I would definitely check her out. I don't know where she all ships to, but 
hopefully she ships to wherever you guys are. I'm roll her up. So cute, I love it. Okay, and then I just have a couple of packages from Amazon. I think I know what these are. I think this is my fall stuff that I ordered. Oh, need to cut this open or something. I actually don't even know if I want to show this. I kind of want to keep it a secret. Let me see what it is. Yeah, I think I might want to keep this a secret because I'm going to use it for a video. Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> they're literally so cute. But I'm I'm going to keep it a secret. Oh, I hate to do that, but I am. I might keep this next one a secret too. I have another box, but <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to show it. Let me open it and see first. Yeah, I'm not gonna show the other one either. I'm gonna be using them in an upcoming video though, so you'll see them. Okay, so I guess that's it for my mail. I will talk to you guys later. Hey guys, what's up? Happy Thursday. I am just out taking Olive for a walk right now. <laughs> She's having fun exploring the new trail. And as am I, it's very nice. I was filming earlier today, it's about 1 p.m. I think, um, and I was halfway through the video and all I've really wanted to go. <laughs> so I'm taking a break and going for a little jaunt and then I'm gonna finish filming that video when I get back home and I have another video that I need to film after that as well because tomorrow is gonna be a really busy day for me and I'm not gonna get a chance to film. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna be doing for the rest of this afternoon and then I'll probably be editing this evening hear weird noise but I think it's a bird also this evening I did want to do kind of like a self-care little evening um so I will vlog tonight I think today's gonna be the last day I vlog because I want to edit this video and get it up the weather's so nice also it's like 20 degrees today there's people swimming in the lake and it's just perfect um so yeah, I'm gonna enjoy the rest of my walk and I'll probably catch up with you guys later this evening. Hey guys, it is the evening. Um, I said earlier that I wanted to have like kind of a self-care night tonight. Um, I did have a bath, so that was relaxing and nice. Um, and while I was in that bath, I made some notes about the video I was gonna film and then I ended up filming and then I ended up editing. So okay kind of turned into more of a work night than a self-care relaxation night. It is 8.49 p.m. right now. I do have to get up early tomorrow, but I'm not like super tired right now. So I think that um, I am going to paint my nails. I'm actually going to be getting my lashes done tomorrow as well. Hillary's gonna do my lashes and then we're gonna cook dinner together. So it should be fun. Um, I haven't even told you guys what I have a busy day tomorrow, so I have to wake up um, oh, I keep burping I have to um, Drive to Nanaimo in the morning because my car has an appointment. They had to order parts in and it took forever and Whatever so the parts are finally here and I have to take my car in at for an appointment at 10 15 So I have to leave here at like uh before eight probably to be safe because I have to drive all the way across Nanaimo too. So I have to leave early. Um, well, that's not that early, but I have to get up early because I you know, have to get ready and have things to do before that. So I'm going to drive there, do that. Um, and then I literally need to drive right back because I have to go to Hillary's at two to get my eyelashes done. And between that, I also need to drop Olive off and grab some stuff at home. So it's gonna be very tight. Didn't even think about what I'm gonna eat. I'm probably gonna end up getting the A&W nuggets. Oh boy, oh boy. Hey guys, what's up? Oh my goodness, I'm walking on a busy freaking street right now. Hopefully you can hear me. I just finished a workout at the gym. I drove to Nanaimo this morning, so my car is in the shop <clears throat> right now. Um, and it's only a few blocks from the gym that I still have a membership here, so I decided to go and work out. It was really good. I did legs. Um, I feel like I pulled a muscle a little bit on my last exercise. Um, so I 
it was my last exercise anyways, so um, yeah, I'm done with that now. They said that my car would take about an hour to an hour and a half, and it's been about an hour and 15 minutes now, so I'm hoping that they're gonna call soon because I'm really pressed for time today. I have an eyelash appointment, um, like right as soon as this is done. Um, so I'm just waiting for them to call. I'm gonna pop into the health food store here and get a post-workout snack. Got some snacks. And I also bought this little reusable bag because um, I have like no bags to get my groceries anymore because I left them when I moved. Um, so I got this muffin. I'm gonna eat it right now. This It's so loud here, I'm so sorry. And then I got these little bites. I was like looking all over the package to see if they're vegan and then it literally says in big letters there. And then I also got this um, superfood bar. I couldn't decide which one I wanted to get. I think I'm gonna eat the muffin right now. Um, but I figured these are gonna be good for when I'm out and about, um, like going for runs and walks and stuff. So just keep those. Good morning guys, happy Saturday. I was gonna finish the vlog yesterday but i feel like i didn't really get that much footage um i just ended up making a dinner with my friends in the evening and i think i only got one clip of me and hillary at the grocery store <laughs> nice one but yesterday was a good day. Hillary did my lashes. They look so freaking good. She is amazing. Um, I love them. And then we got some groceries, made a dinner. We made like a big roasted veggie dinner. It was so good and just kind of hung out. And then I came home just after nine and went straight to bed. <laughs> I've already taken Olive for a little W-A-L-K this morning did some dishes and now I have just been reading. I'm reading Becoming Supernatural by Dr. Joe Dispenza. Um, having my coffee and yeah, it's very nice. I'm actually going to water some plants right now, I think. <laughs> 